Good morning, 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 oh, the scratches, we got Teddy, good morning, okay, welcome back to a new day, a new adventure, we're getting straight up and not messing around, we're getting out and about, because we have things to do, but man, oh man, let me tell you, that feels like it's 2009 again. If you haven't heard, Microsoft fixed the old Call of Duty servers. I'm talking MW2, MW3, Black Ops 1, and Black Ops 2 are now playable again on the Xbox. Whether you have an Xbox 360, Xbox One, Xbox Series S, or Series X, you can play the old Call of Duties. And I've been doing a little bit of that. By a little bit, I mean a whole lot of it. It's been a bit since I've done this, so the question is, can I make it? Well, that's a great start. <laughs> now it's all wet now. All right, it's all wet. Much better. Now, I don't know what you lads are doing, but we need to get going. Are you hungry? <laughs> okay, okay. Okay. So you gotta grab that tripod. Tell the kitty cat goodbye, sir. Get the phone wall in case. Give a little... Just like that. Shoot them. Now let's go. Right, first stop, a brekkie and... Good morning, Chloe. I've been up before you. <laughs> yeah, but it's the first time we're seeing you. And oh dear, oh dear. There are a lot of cars. So hopefully, we can get a seat pretty quick. And we are going to Canela's Breakfast and Lunch Cafe. And just like that, that's seat in the house. You already know we got the royal breakfast with ham, hash browns, and of course, the cinnamon roll pancake. Ah, oh, that breakfast hit the spot. We were actually there earlier than usual, and there were still a lot of people there. Probably because it's such a nice day up now. We're at Lowe's. And why are we at Lowe's again? To finish a desk, we need stain. We need to return some things that we didn't use. So this should go great. I have no idea what I'm doing, <laughs> but we're gonna figure it out. We already have Halloween stuff out. What is going on, man? So this is what we came for. And we're going for the medium all night, yeah? I don't know, yeah. Oh, we don't know. What do you guys think? Medium, dark, or the natural? We've made the decision. Medium all night it is. Now, what are we using to apply this? It says to use like a foam brush or a bristle brush. Okay, foam brush. Neither of those I see here. So uh, what brush are we looking for? Right there, foam brush. Yeah. We're getting a big boy. Yeah. Got our brushes. I think to put the stain in. And now I need some sandpaper. We have the sandpaper. Chloe went with the 400 extra fine super sponge. And now we're looking for something to place the wood on while we stain it. All the supplies acquired. And now we're off to something I'm very excited about. So earlier this summer, we found a local or small coffee company called Northburg Coffee Co. And they said they were gonna be back in town this day, or this weekend. So we ordered six bottled vanilla lattes. You guys, oh, they're so good. And you know we're gonna pick another one up for today. And you get in the strawberry lemonade? Yes. If they have it. Ooh, yes, 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 yes. I have spotted you. Get in my belly. Coffee acquired. We also got a crew neck and Merch. A, we'll show you when we get okay, get to the car. But man, that's good. That is good. And we got our six bottle lattes. Had to get another one, of course. You know, you had to have more. Oh. Never too much caffeine. Oh, so good. I'm gonna drink them all today. <laughs> all six of them. Oh, so good. You wanna try? So I good. love her coffee. So good. So here's what we got. The six vanilla bean lattes. The Northburg Coffee Co. crew neck. I really like the colors. The style looks great. But these. Oh, I'm excited. I like these bottles too. These are sick. <laughs> but hello, Pascalis. Hello. How are ya? How you doing? And there's Yuki. 
Pytash from the future real quick. I don't think I actually talked about the Northburg coffee and how it is the best coffee. And I want to give support to a local and small business. So I'm going to pop up their Instagram right here, Northburg Coffee Co. And the link will be down in the description. Highly, highly recommend going and checking out their Instagram. And if you're in the area, checking out their products. Because, man, let me tell you. Some of the best coffee, the best homemade syrups. This hands down the best. So if you guys are going and checking out their Instagram, make sure leaving a comment saying that Pytash sent you. But would you just look at that view now back to the vlog so northburg thank you thank you very much for having the best coffee in town and now it's time for the fun part of getting the desk taken apart stand finished and putting it back together but first we gotta change out of this and into this oh she's already gone and done bloody got it set up i don't even know what i just said <laughs> so let the sanding commence Oh, so smooth. <laughs> All right, crikey, bro. Let's get it standing. Would you like to go outside? Ah, ba, 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 where are you going? Would we like to go outside before the staining commences? Yes? Okay. Oh my God, a bucket. <laughs> the sanding is complete. Next step, putting the Danish oil. Okay, it says into the pan. Shake container thoroughly. Flood the surface using brush or cloth. Allow penetrate for 15 minutes. Then wipe surface dry. Ready for use in eight to ten hours. Wow. All right. Get it in there. No, you. What? Think I pushed down hard enough? <laughs> Got it opened. Got some of the stain or Danish oil into the pan. Now it's time to start the staining. I don't know how well you can tell on camera, but in person, this looks a thousand times better than it did before. Now we let it sit for like... Seven to ten hours? Seven to ten hours. Nice. <laughs> Hold up! Chloe almost forgot a crucial part. After 15 minutes, you gotta wipe it down with the cloth. And now we sit back, relax, and wait. Well, you have fun sitting there for seven to ten hours. Let me know when it's dry. All right, lads. If you want to go outside, you're going to have to listen. And I have a treat. Can you sniff it? Sniff, 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 sniff. Yeah, it's very good sniff. Quick update on the desk here. Looking nice, looking nice. And the doggos are chilling. And I got to say, you couldn't have picked a better day to do it. I mean, look at the sky. I mean, this cloud's a little dark but shouldn't rain but we're gonna leave this thing here to do its thing we did only put one coat on it you can't put multiple if you want a little bit darker i'm going to stick with the one coat it looks pretty good actually so we'll let it do its thing we're gonna go grab some lunch quick stop at romeo's for lunch this is the mediterranean salad with chicken and turkish limon dressing absolutely amazing 10 out of 10. the romeo's club with ham turkey and bacon and a sun-dried tomato mayo dressing and I forgot to show you guys what it was called. It's called Romeo's Pizzeria and Mediterranean Kitchen. Absolutely phenomenal. Best, one of the best places in town, and I'll tell you that Mediterranean salad is the best thing on the menu. Hard to see. Well, she know. It's about seven-ish hours later. Should be dried and ready to go. So let's take it, put it back in the office. And there's the desk. And man, oh man, does it look so much better now. That's finished. 
Happy? Yes. Now you gotta put it all back together. I mean, I even unplug it in there, so. <laughs> and there it is, all set up with the ultra wide monitor. Very nice, very boho. With the desk and everything being completed now, you can't tell me that this isn't a sick looking office. She's got plans everywhere and they're all real, except for this one, which is <laughs> insane. There's plans over there, plans over there, plans over there. And little Easter egg, that dog up there, we actually got that before you put in Pascal as like a foreshadowing that we will get a golden retriever. And we named that golden retriever up there, Simon. The bandana he's wearing, Chloe actually made that. I had a great time putting that, I had a great time putting together this desk, staining it, finishing it, and getting it all together and actually finished. Because this was the first actual, like, I guess you could call it woodworking project we did. We didn't actually do any of the actual woodworking, but I'll tell you what, there's, we went to Lowe's to pick up this tabletop. We were looking at a couple different ones and we met some customers there and they were, beyond helpful. They went above and beyond to help us out and kind of guide us through what needed to be done, what we were looking for, best products to use, and this is what we came out with. You guys can say, oh, we did this wrong, did that wrong, whatever it may be. Like I said, this is my first ever time doing it. So if you guys have any other little projects you would like us to work on, let me know down below in the comments. If you guys have any exploration ideas you want us to go on, let me know down below in the comments as well. But hopefully you guys did enjoy this one. Based on feedback in my live streams and the comments here on the videos and everything, you guys seem to be enjoying the vlogs, which makes me so, so happy. At the beginning of July, we were projected to reach 3,400 subscribers at the end of 2023. At the end. And now here we are, over 3,500 subs. So thank you guys so, so much. I couldn't have ever imagined that you guys would enjoy the vlogs as much as you are. And the fact that you are, and it's just me kind of living my life, sharing it with you guys is incredible. Because when I first started recording these vlogs, I was like, I don't know if I really do enough to actually create all these vlogs and put them out. This is where I'm gonna leave you. Hope you guys did enjoy this one. I appreciate each and every one of you tuning into these vlogs leaving a like, commenting, and subscribing, doing all the notifications to be notified every time I go live or I post a video. So thank you guys very, very much. When I started this whole YouTube journey, I never thought we'd be where we're at today. So thank you guys very much for that. I do appreciate it. And I will catch you guys in the next video.